In the vast cosmos where galaxies stretch beyond imagination and the night sky is filled with endless mysteries, we find ourselves searching for meaning. Our search for life is ultimately a search for ourselves, a quest to understand who we are and where we fit in the grand tapestry of the universe. For centuries we've gazed upward and wondered, are we alone? Is there anyone else out there, looking back at us from another world? Today, science is closing in on an answer. With powerful telescopes and advanced technology, we are peering deeper into the cosmos than ever before. We scan the stars, seeking another world like ours, a pale blue dot with oceans, clouds, and maybe life. Each new discovery brings hope that we are not alone. The universe is immense with more stars than grains of sand on Earth. Each star could host planets and each planet could hold secrets waiting to be uncovered. Surely another Earth must exist, somewhere out there, orbiting a distant sun, waiting for us to find it. This quest isn't just about aliens, it's about understanding our place in the universe and what it means to be alive on this fragile world. Discovering another Earth would transform our perspective on life's origins and rarity. It would challenge everything we know about biology, evolution and the uniqueness of our home. Each exoplanet discovery brings us closer but the ultimate prize, a true Earth-like planet has always eluded us. The search has been long, filled with anticipation and wonder. Today August 5, 2025, that changes. A new chapter in our cosmic story begins. NASA has released a stunning new image of Proxima b, orbiting our closest stellar neighbor, Proxima Centauri. This is more than just a photograph, it's a window into another world. Once a ghost in the data, Proxima b is now a world with features, color and the promise of something truly special. We can almost imagine standing on its surface looking up at an alien sky. For the first time we are seeing the potential for another pale blue dot, beckoning us from across the interstellar void. The dream of finding another Earth is no longer just science fiction, it is becoming reality. To truly grasp the significance of this image let's embark on a journey to our closest stellar neighbor, Proxima Centauri, located just over four light years away from Earth. In the vastness of space, this is practically next door, making it a fascinating subject for astronomers and space enthusiasts alike. Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf, which is the most common type of star in our galaxy. Unlike our Sun, red dwarfs are faint and cool, emitting only a fraction of the light and heat. Yet, their abundance means they play a crucial role in the search for planets beyond our solar system. In 2016, astronomers made a groundbreaking discovery, a planet orbiting Proxima Centauri, named Proxima b. This exoplanet instantly became the closest known world outside our solar system, sparking excitement and curiosity about its potential to harbor life. Its remarkable proximity makes Proxima b a prime candidate for detailed study and perhaps one day, even robotic or human exploration. Scientists are eager to learn more about its atmosphere, surface, and potential for life. Proxima b orbits within the so-called habitable zone the region around a star where temperatures could allow liquid water to exist on a planet's surface, a key ingredient for life as we know it. However, because Proxima Centauri is much cooler and dimmer than our Sun, its habitable zone is much closer in. Proxima b orbits at just 7.5 million kilometers from its star, about 20 times closer than Earth is to the Sun. This close orbit means a year on Proxima b lasts only 11.2 Earth days. Imagine celebrating your birthday every week and a half. The planet is also likely tidally locked, with one side always facing its star in perpetual daylight while the other side remains in endless night. This creates extreme conditions with scorching heat on one side and freezing cold on the other. For years, scientists have debated whether such a world could truly be habitable. Could life survive the intense stellar flares from its parent star? or is Proxima b just a barren rock, its surface sterilized by radiation? Without a direct image, we could only speculate about its true nature. All our knowledge came from indirect observations and careful analysis of starlight. Proxima b remained a tantalizing mystery, fueling anticipation for the next generation of telescopes and instruments that could finally reveal its secrets. Now with this groundbreaking new image, the mystery of Proxima b is finally beginning to unravel. We are on the verge of a new era in exoplanet exploration. For the first time, we have a window into this nearby world, offering us a glimpse of what lies beyond our solar system and bringing us closer to answering the age-old question, are we alone in the universe? Before this image, our knowledge of Proxima b came from indirect data. 
Detected via the radial velocity method we knew it was a rocky, terrestrial planet, like Earth but a bit larger. Its mass is at least 1.17 times Earth's, and its diameter about 1.1 times greater. Gravity would be slightly stronger but not extreme. Proxima b orbits its star every 11.2 days, close enough for possible liquid water, but its red dwarf parent bombards it with flares and tidal locking means one side bakes while the other freezes. The eyeball planet model suggested a habitable twilight ring between extremes. Was it a scorched rock, a frozen wasteland, or something in between? The data gave us a framework but not the answer, for that we needed to see it. NASA's new image is a revolution, a direct photograph of another world. Proxima b appears as a pale blue crescent, illuminated by its ruddy star. The blue hue suggests an atmosphere and possibly oceans, echoing Earth's own color. Wisps of white hint at clouds, evidence of a weather system and water cycle. Along the terminator, subtle color variations suggest landmasses, perhaps continents. This isn't a uniform water world or barren rock, but a dynamic planet with diverse surfaces. The image transforms Proxima b from a data point into a tangible place. It answers decade-old questions. Yes, it has an atmosphere. Yes, there's likely liquid water. Yes, there are continents. This is a watershed moment for planetary science and astrobiology. For the first time, we can directly study a potentially habitable world. The search for another Earth has reached a new era. Proxima b, once a mystery, is now a world within reach. The universe just got a little smaller and a lot more interesting. Capturing a direct image of an exoplanet is one of astronomy's greatest technical feats. Exoplanets are faint, lost in the glare of their parent stars, like spotting a firefly beside a searchlight. This image was made possible by the James Webb Space Telescope, working with new ground-based observatories. JWST's massive mirror and infrared sensitivity were crucial, as Proxima b emits most of its light in the infrared. Advanced coronagraphy blocked out the star's light, revealing the planet's faint glow. On the ground, telescopes like the ELT used adaptive optics to sharpen the view. The final image is a composite, combining hundreds of hours of data from space and Earth. It's a triumph of global collaboration and cutting-edge technology. This achievement pushes the limits of what's possible in astronomy. For the first time, we can truly see another Earth-like world. With the image in hand, scientists turn to spectroscopy, analyzing the planet's light for chemical fingerprints. The spectrum revealed water vapor, confirming what the blue color suggested. Proxima b has water in its atmosphere. Water vapor means a water cycle, clouds, rain, and a stable climate. The spectrum also showed carbon dioxide and nitrogen, key components for habitability. Most intriguing, there's a trace of oxygen, a possible biosignature, though not definitive. On Earth, oxygen is a byproduct of life, its presence here is tantalizing. Curiously, methane is nearly absent, raising new questions about Proxima b's chemistry and potential life. These findings shift the question from, could it be habitable, to, what kind of world is it? The light from Proxima b is finally telling its story. We are closer than ever to answering the question, are we alone? Earth's twin has never felt more accurate. For decades, astronomers have searched the cosmos for a planet that mirrors our own, and now Proxima b stands out as a remarkable candidate. Proxima b and Earth are similar in size and mass, both likely with rocky surfaces and metallic cores. These shared traits make Proxima b one of the most intriguing exoplanets ever discovered, sparking imaginations about what might exist on its surface. But their differences are profound, shaping two very distinct worlds. Earth orbits a stable yellow sun, bathing our planet in steady life-giving light. In contrast, Proxima b circles a volatile red dwarf, a star prone to flares and dramatic changes. On Proxima b, the sun would loom large and red, casting a perpetual sunset glow across the landscape. The sky would be tinted with hues never seen on Earth. Its tidally locked orbit means one side basks in endless day, the other in eternal night. This creates a world of extremes with scorching heat on one side and freezing cold on the other. The new image supports the eyeball planet model but with a twist, a thick atmosphere and vast oceans allow heat to circulate, creating a global weather system that could support life in unexpected ways. Habitability may be confined to the twilight ring, the terminator zone, where temperatures are mild and water can exist. This narrow band could be a haven for life balancing light and darkness. Here, life could thrive in the gentle reddish light, adapting to an environment both familiar and alien. The hints of clouds and continents suggest a dynamic, complex world, with weather patterns and surface features that might rival Earth's own diversity. 
Proxima b is alien, yet recognizably Earth-like, a paradox that fuels our curiosity. It's a world that challenges our understanding of habitability, pushing scientists to rethink what it means for a planet to support life. The comparison deepens our appreciation for both planets, highlighting the delicate balance that makes Earth unique while revealing the possibilities that await beyond our solar system. We are not just searching for another Earth, we may have found one, and with it, a new chapter in the story of life in the universe. To grasp this discovery, let's visualize the data. Side-by-side -side charts show Earth and Proxima b similar in size but orbiting very different stars. A map of the Proxima Centauri system places Proxima b snugly in the habitable zone, yet exposed to stellar flares. Atmospheric charts reveal nitrogen, carbon dioxide, water vapor, and a trace of oxygen paralleling Earth's own air. A speculative map, based on the image, shows a tidally locked world a vast ocean on the day side, a central continent, swirling clouds, and a temperate twilight ring. The Terminator Zone emerges as the most promising region for life. These visuals transform Proxima b from numbers into a world we can almost imagine visiting. The data comes alive, making this distant planet feel real. Proxima b is no longer just a possibility, it's a place. The discovery of a potentially habitable world just four light years away is a turning point for humanity. Proxima b is no longer an abstract point of light, it's a destination with weather, geology, and the potential for life. This changes our understanding of the universe and our place within it. The Drake Equation, once theoretical, now has a real data point, a nearby world that could support life. If such a planet exists next door, perhaps Earth-like worlds are common throughout the galaxy. This discovery will drive new science, technology, and dreams of interstellar exploration. Projects like Breakthrough Starshot now have a clear target. We stand at a crossroads, a second genesis may be within reach. Proxima b offers a mirror to our own planet, deepening our understanding of habitability and evolution. The journey ahead is just beginning. As we gaze at this new blue marble, we must ask, now that we've found another potential Earth, what will we do next?